Hi, I'm Heather Faulkner. And I'm Robert Hardacre. And we're art curators for this year's Handmade 2014. And we're here today to tell you a little bit about what we've got coming up at the festival. I got involved with Handmade Festival last year as one of the Attic artists as we did the art for the festival last year. It was really successful, uh, which is why I wanted to do it again this year. It also means that we get um, De Montfort University students on board. This year we have um, third year fine art students uh, creating mainly projection based work for the festival. Although I am the curator, I'm also creating work for downstairs at Firebug. Um, I'm doing collaborative drawings uh, with my brother Alex Fortner, who is a illustrator and graphic designer. This is um, one of the drawings, well the start of one of the drawings that I'll be doing. I'm doing three large wooden boards. Um, this is just one of them. This particular small part of the drawing took me six hours, so the other two boards are going to take me a long time. But uh, I'm really enjoying it this far. Uh, it's going really well, so a lot more to see when the festival is up and running. Hi, I'm Robert Hardacre. Um, for Handmade Festival, I'm helping Heather with some of the curating. Um, and I'm also doing a piece with a dancer called Lewis Holt. Um, which will involve us dancing and uh, doing some choreographed movement um, as part of a film which will be shown at the Guildhall. It also involves Tarkon Pada, in case you haven't guessed. Hi, um, I'm Melissa Morgan and here's a selection of my work that I'll be shown at Hanson Hall for the Handmade Festival. My work is surrounded around uh, projection and the mundane everyday objects. I've been projecting mundane everyday objects into windows so that they can be viewed by the public from the outside. Um, so I'm hoping to do a large scale projection of taps, possibly running water in the wrong direction, um, on a large scale onto Hanson Hall and also inside Hanson Hall as well. I've chosen everyday objects because I wanted to make art become more accessible um, for everyone to see sort of wherever they are and whenever. That's why I've chosen the everyday objects as sort of a taller approach. So they're quite universal objects that we can all relate to. I'm Freya Willett and my work's going to be upstairs in Firebug. I work with rolled and folded acetate through which I project film and light. And the acetate is suspended from the ceiling and it rotates. And as the light goes through it, it makes cool patterns and shapes all over the wall. Hello, my name is Abigail Wood and I'm based in the Crumbling Cookie in the basement. I work with still images and projections based from found stills that I found in my grandparents' house. And from there I make digital collages which I then have developed onto projections looking at the differences between colour to show a passage through time. I'm Sarah Gray. Um, I'm going to be one of the artists in the Crumbling Cookie. Uh, my work is a moving image piece that uses uh, appropriated images and footage from the internet. This has just been a small taster of what we've got planned for this year's festival. Um, to find out more, go to www.handmadefestival.co.uk. Uh, tickets are available now and the festival is from the 2nd to the 4th of May. Come on down! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>